Parkstone International is pleased to present you. Bauhaus? Written by Michael C. Ebenbrot and Lutz Scope. The Bauhaus movement, meaning the House of Building, developed in three German cities, it began in Weimar between 1919 and 1925, then continued in Dessau, from 1925 to 1932, and finally ended in 1932 to 1933 in Berlin. Three leaders presided over the growth of the movement, Walter Gropius, from 1919 to 1928, Hans Meyer, from 1928 to 1930, and Ludwig Mies van der Rohe, from 1930 to 1933. Combining new styles in architecture, design, and painting, the Bauhaus aspired to be an expression of a generational utopia, striving to free artists facing a society that remained conservative in spite of the revolutionary efforts of the post-war period. Using the most modern materials, the Bauhaus was born out of the precepts of William Morris and the Arts and Crafts movement, introducing new forms, inspired by the most ordinary of objects into everyday life. The most influential among the Bauhaus artists were Annie Albers, Joseph Albers, Marianne Brandt, Marcel Breuer, Lionel Feininger, Ludwig Hilbersheimer, Paul Clay, Vasily Kandisky, and Lothar Schreier. The Bauhaus was one of the most important and momentous cultural manifestations of the 20th century. There is no doubt about it. It is more than ever a phenomenon of global dimensions. Today, the Bauhaus is embedded in the public consciousness, it is held in high esteem and, depending on one's interests, occasionally glorified or denounced. But recognition, and positive esteem are prevalent. If you wish to learn more about the story of Bauhaus, you can find the book on the present platforms.